Hello, and welcome to the Trade in Tech online wholesale and retail training session. My name is Hayden Howard. I'll be your presenter today. And let me tell you, I am so excited to get this started. I have put so much work into putting this training session together for you. And I can tell you, there is nothing like this on the internet anywhere else. So if you stick with me for the next 60 minutes or so, I promise you that I will teach you quite a few things. And by the end of it, you will definitely know not only where to buy wholesale electronics, but also how to purchase them in bulk and scale your company to the next level. So without further ado, let's get started. I'm ready to jump in. I hope you are too. So I want to introduce myself right off the bat, um, properly introduce myself, I should say. My name is Hayden Howard. I'm from Los Angeles, California. And if you had a couple words to describe me, I would consider myself a serial entrepreneur. People know me, my friends know me for being a person who has always gone out and started a new business, love making money. That's always fun too. Um, and I can tell you that my first business I started was at the age of 22. Um, it was a successful business. It was a profitable business. And so um, that was a good start for me. But I can tell you along the way, I've had plenty of failures, uh, probably more than most, but that's okay because I'm willing to risk it and take, in order to take it to the next level. So I currently run two companies right now. Both of them are in very healthy condition. Both of them are profitable as well. Um, and so you might have seen me on other media publications. Um, one of my biggest media publications was Inc. Magazine, where I was rated as a top rated business owner for one of the fastest growing companies in America. So I can promise you that the stuff I'm teaching right now is not something I learned from somebody else. It's something that I have actually done myself. It's very, very important for all those internet gurus out there today. So let me tell you a little bit about the story of Trade in Tech before we dive into all the training. Um, we started in Spokane, Washington. I uh, started the business in 2012. Um, I worked by myself in a one-bedroom apartment, um, and I purchased phones on Craigslist and resold them on eBay. That was pretty much the simple way of doing that. At that time, the iPhone 5 had just came out, so smartphones were getting very, very popular and revolutionary. And so a lot more people were purchasing them and becoming a lot more available. I was one of the few people um, that was purchasing phones before Verizon, before AT&T, before Sprint, and all these other major corporations were buying back these used devices. So I had a serious head start from everybody and was able to see some success. From that point on, I ended up hiring about three people, and we expanded the business to our own office space in Spokane, Washington. Uh, we quickly grew out of that, to say the least. Spokane is a limited um, economy, to say the least, up there. So I took a big leap in 2014 and decided to shut our operations down in Spokane, Washington, and expand it and move to Los Angeles, California. And from that point on, we really grew. We really exploded. I ended up hiring about 30 employees throughout the series of it. We had a 4,000-square-foot office space, so... A lot, a lot was going on. Uh, we started purchasing from a lot more retail stores and pawn shops and quickly met more wholesalers and recyclers as well. Um, from that point, we not only selling on eBay, but we expanded to stores like Swappa, selling directly to retail stores and also wholesale resellers all throughout the world. So I can tell you our success. Um, like I said, we started in 2012 and we've been in operating them since then profitably. Um, since then, we have generated over $30 million in sales, whether that's through eBay and other e-commerce channels, as well as wholesale. And we have sold over 250,000 devices. This includes iPhones, iPads, MacBooks, Samsung devices, everything. And in 2018, we were ranked number 427 on the Inc. 500 list as one of the fastest growing companies in America. So that was pretty cool. Um, that gave us a huge boost in publication and credibility to our name as well. Very, very excited to earn that. So I can tell you that this industry is not massive, but all the people in it know each other, to say the least. And so we work with some of the most respected companies, companies like Mass Mobile, We Sell Cellular, Early Upgrade. Bright Star and Global Geeks and Solarcom, all of these guys are some of the most respected wholesalers in the industry. Um, some of them are doing over a hundred million a year. Even some of them are doing billions every single year. 
So we have worked with all of these companies. You can contact them directly too and use this as a reference that you saw us from these training. Um, but I can tell you that our reputation is very well respected in the industry and we make sure that we only work with the most respected wholesalers and dealers as well. Now, this training is for quite a few people, but I organized it so it would reflect on a lot of different people. Um, so I can tell you that this training is for people who are interested in buying and reselling electronics, whether you've gotten started or you already have a business and you're operating, you have more employees than I've ever had. Um, either way, it's people who are interested in looking to get started or looking to expand their business. This is also a great focus for retailers who are interested in sp expanding their business and buying and selling and wholesale. And this is a great opportunity as well for ho wholesalers who just want to find more customers. A lot of people who are watching this already know who I am and possibly have already done business with me as well. So I can tell you that there's going to be a lot of information here I can provide to you that will relate to you a lot, be able to help you grow your business. And so just a few things people say about us. Some of you guys may know some of these companies that are on this list that have mentioned our name and, and stuff. And so I can tell you that uh, Ahmad from Global Geeks, one of my good friends, um, he is, to say the least, we've tried to work together a lot, as in he's tried to hire me onto his team. Um, but I've always wanted to just stay on my own side. But I absolutely love Ahmad. Great company, great guys. And he told me that uh, he's always impressed by trading tax marketing strategies. We're always, we're very unique. We try to do things different, take it to the next level. So Justin Cardos as well from Equinox Electronics. He's up in Northern California. I've worked with him for over five years. Uh, he is very honest and trustworthy. He's also said the same about us and that we're always willing to help others. Uh, Mark as well from Phone Repair Co. Yeah, I believe he's out in, he has Colorado. And so I have worked with him for a long time and have tried to help him uh, in every way I could. And it turned out that actually helped him meet some of his best clients. So pretty excited about that. And David Shem from Wireless Trading. He's up here in Los Angeles, California too. Um, I've worked with him for five years. Great guy to work with, honest, easy to work with. And as well, to uh, uh, he's told us that it's a, been a pleasure to do business with every single time. And so Dan Moore too is DE Electronics. He's a big Amazon guy. And so I've helped him a lot in the wholesale industry and been able to understand it. And he can tell tell you with certainty that Trade in Tech and myself alone knows how this industry works. So those are just a couple of guys that have respect for us that we've worked for in the industry and have said good things about us. Now, this training session, I'm going to make a commitment to you. Now, by the end of this training session, I will be able to help you understand the marketing and sales techniques you can use to start or expand your business. Okay, there is no point in trying to do it on your own and figure it out all by yourself. All right, I have been successful. Copy my success, go from there. So I'm going to provide you a bunch of strategies, a bunch of platforms, a bunch of people as well that you can work with. Um, and we can help you expand or start your business and become successful in this industry. And let me tell you, I have something very special for you. So if you watch until the end of this, I'm going to give you access to some exclusive content. And I might even, I've thought about it, give you access to some of my personal clients. So these are the clients that we personally have done over $30 million in revenue with. Um, if you like this and you follow till the end of it, I might just give you access to it. So stick around. You'll see how good this offer really is. And so... Before we get started, I want to talk about how you're going to benefit from this training. And by the end of this training, I want to be able to help you understand multiple things. Number one, I want to be able to help you understand how to build a multi-million dollar business in the electronics industry. Guys, it is not easy. It is not easy to start a business. It is not easy to grow a business to over a million dollars a year. So you're going to need some help or you're going to, be a, you're going to have a lot of mistakes along the way. So what else I want to help you with is I want to help you not only know how, but where to find unlimited new customers on autopilot. Now that sounds crazy. I know that sounds crazy and a lot of people have no idea what I'm talking about there. So I hope you're excited about this, but I will show you strategies that I personally use to have customers, new leads, and actually very high value clients come in the door every single day while I'm sleeping. 
And so it's pretty crazy, but I'll teach you the strategies, software programs as well in order to be able to do that. The next thing I want to be able to do and the last thing is I want to be able to help you find the highest paying buyers in the world from your computer or your phone. So the industry is very competitive and everybody is always looking for the highest paying buyer and the best stock and everything you to get can get. So I'm going to teach you ways and strategies and introduce you to people possibly as well. that are some of the highest paying buyers in the world so you can get started and you can sell devices for the highest prices possible. So I hope you're all excited for this. I've put together a lot for you and let's get started. So here are the topics we're going to talk about. Number one, workflow. You need to understand how to buy and sell in bulk, manage your inventory and create systems. This is called your workflow. Next is sales funnels. I'm going to teach you how to build a proper sales funnel that captures leads and maintains customer relationships. A lot of this can be done automatically. A lot of people right now currently too have no idea what I'm talking about. So stick around, pay attention to this because it provides a ton of value. The next thing I'm going to talk about is marketing. Get your business recognized on various platforms with strategic advertising methods. Okay, this isn't a typical business. Buying and selling uh, used electronics is a new industry. So it's hard to be recognized in a lot of areas unless you have a massive marketing budget. But I'm going to teach you how to be recognized on various platforms without spending tons of money. Um, also, expansion. This is what a lot of people want to learn is you want to learn how to automate your regular tasks and focus on growing your business. I want to take you to that next level. Whether you're doing no sales right now, you're doing a million dollars or you're doing $10 million a month. It doesn't matter. You need to learn how to expand and monetize your current operations or your future operations so you can grow. So I'm going to help you out with that a lot. So let's dive in. Let's get started. So let me tell you though, right off the bat, before you jump in and you start contacting customers, create a business plan. Seven out of 10 companies do not have a written, written business plan. That's just unbelievable. Let me tell you something. NBA players, NFL players, MLB players, whoever is professional in any game, they don't play the game without knowing a plan, all right? They practice over and over and over, and they know it inside and out. The exact same should apply to your business. So write out a plan and operating procedures before you start anything, and you'll find a lot more success. Okay, so one thing I want to talk about a lot of people are doing right now. This is the old marketing strategy, okay? This is what all the old timers are doing. People are pounding the phones and everything. Um, I'm going to tell you one thing. I personally don't like picking up the phone. I'll reply to you via text, but I don't have time to talk on the phone a lot. So anybody who tries to call me, especially anybody I don't know, I'm probably not going to answer your phone call. That's just because the world moves at a fast pace these days, and I may even move a little bit faster, but I don't have all the time in the world to sit on the phone call with people. So what people are doing right now is they're going online and they're finding people, whether it's on social media or through a directory or some way they're going to find them. They're capturing their email or their phone number, and they're calling them. So this is strictly solicitation. They don't have their consent really to do that. They pulled their information off the internet or Craigslist or whatever it is, and they're calling somebody hoping to get in touch with somebody to pitch them. Okay, so finally, you might get an answer the first day, the second day, the third day, but you finally get an answer, and you're trying to sell a product to a customer that has no idea who you are. They don't trust you. They don't know you. They don't believe in you. And you're going to find out that most of them aren't going to be interested in your products. This is the old strategy. I do not suggest doing this strategy. If you're doing this strategy, that's okay. You might have found success, but I'm going to tell you the future is changing and a lot of people are doing things differently. And I'm going to show you a new strategy that I use that is much more successful, way higher conversion rate, and I don't have to call people. I can literally sleep and make it happen. So let me show you. The new strategy is creating a lead generation machine. So this is what's called a sales funnel. Now, every single one of these sections, imagine them as a page on your website. You are going to create a funnel and bring the customers to you. And not only are you going to bring the customers to you, but you're going to pre-qualify each lead based on the interests and behaviors of your current funnel. Okay, so step one, let me explain this. You're going to create an offer, a giveaway, some freebie, that people can have okay so download this free 
ebook, um, get access to our free trading groups. That's one. And people, what people have to do from that point on is they'll click on your offer. And in order to get access to your offer, they have to exchange their contact information. So you can get their name, their phone number, their email. That should be plenty to start. Uh, and you collect their information. Now, from that point on, they are in your system. You have captured that lead and they have shown interest in the original offer that you gave away, which was related to your industry. So what you're going to do is you're going to put them on a mailing list. Or you're going to put them on an advertisement campaign and you're going to engage the customer and find ways to gain their trust. Nobody is going to be sold the first day unless they coming to you and they want to buy. If you're going to them and you're generating these, you are not going to sell the first day. You need to gain the customer's trust and you need to be reliable to them before they spend money with you. And so engage with the customer, contact them, see how they're doing, do free giveaways, surveys, provide them with insightful information to help them grow their business or, or become a better person, whatever it may be. But once you have gained their trust and done that for a what, little while, you need to put together a package of an amazing offer, an absolutely amazing offer in order to sell your product. Do something that gives away 10 times the value of anybody else. And why do I say this? Because you want to give an offer away that's so valuable, everybody says yes. Okay, so provide that information, whatever you can to them and create that offer in that package and, and offer it to them once you have gained their trust. Now, the next thing you can do um, after that, if you haven't sold to everybody and they didn't purchase your, purchase your offer, you can start retargeting them with email and paid advertising saying, hey, you missed out on this offer. Are you still interested? You can purchase it here. Click here. That's how we get a majority of our sales. We retarget highly interested people that have engaged not only in our original offer, but also engaged in our content, and then we're interested in the amazing offer. So this is the series and the patterns we go through for our funnel. So that is a new strategy. It is a mouthful. It is a lot to look over. I understand. And I can tell you that creating these sales funnels is one of the best ways to pre-qualify every single lead to see if they truly are interested in your product. So let me tell you a few success stories about people who have used my strategies and my funnels. Number one is my good friend, Muhammad Zubi. He's from Mass Mobile in Dallas, Texas. And he told me that Hayden's marketing strategies allowed us to automate our prospecting tasks and made sure we only focused on serious customers. Okay, like I said from that sales funnel, that is very, very important. They only focus on serious customers and those serious customers were the ones that made it all the way through their funnel save them a lot of time and energy and headache trying to call and get in contact with people that weren't interested in what they had. And so, and then Donnie Kimball, one of my really good friends from Supreme Buybacks, he lives here in California as well. Um, he said to us, I generated new high quality leads every week with just one advertisement and one funnel. And guys, that's correct. That's exactly what you can do. Whether you're doing Facebook advertising or you're promoting on other platforms, all you need truly is one quality advertisement and one good funnel, and you can capture all of your leads for everything. So those are both Muhammad and Donnie's success stories, and good for them. All right, so here we go. The first section, the workflow. Now, as you look at this, this is a lot to go over. So I'm going to spend some time. Feel free to take notes or screenshots, whatever it may be. Um, but let me start off. But by saying this is the workflow process. Number one, money. So this industry, like every other industry, does have fraud. It does have scammers, okay? So always make sure to secure your money. Use PayPal or inspect and pay, meaning paying after you've inspected the devices, and make sure that you secure your money at all times. If you do not know somebody, do not pay them up front. Always ask for references. Always ask for photos, ask for everything you need in order to assure yourself that these people are legit and you can purchase them. And if you're if you're purchasing a lot on PayPal, and you can use credit cards as well uh, to earn cash back. I've used the Capital One Spark Card and the American Express Plum Card in the past. Uh, they both pay out anywhere from 1.5% to 2% cash back. So that's a great way to earn just a little bit of money on top as well. So like I said, with money... Very important, always secure your money. 
make sure it is never unsecure. The next step is quality control. Now these are used electronics. You do have to test them. They are going to have issues. Phones do break, that happens. So you're gonna to wanna to create a manual diagnostic system or you can use software as well to test your devices. Figure out all of the functions of the phone, the power buttons, the home buttons, the screen display, the cameras, all of that that you need to test and properly test all of your devices before buying and selling these. This industry has very poor quality control issues. So if you can make sure that your devices are properly tested and you have good quality, you're going to do very, very well. Um, the next thing that's very important is your inventory. Inventory is going to take up a lot of your time, whether it's from processing and testing or shipping or storage. So you need to have a system put together. Create an inventory management system or use software programs as well. Have something where you can track everything by serial number and IMEI number and make sure you know the exact issues and how they're tested properly and, and when you bought them and who you bought them from and who you sold them to. There's a lot that goes into it. So managing, a, creating an inventory system or using a software to do that is very, very important. will save you a lot of time. The next thing that I like to talk about as well is shipping. Every single day, if you're selling on e-commerce or wholesale, you're going to be shipping. So it's very important to set up a FedEx and UPS business accounts. Uh, a lot of people may only ship with USPS. That's fine. They're not the best company in the world. But I can tell you, if you start shipping larger quantities, you are going to want to start using FedEx and UPS because you will get better prices. And so set up a business account and find a representative in your area with one of those companies to start with. I always insure my high value packages as well. I insured everything over $2,500. Packages do get lost. We have lost packages and we've been reimbursed for those. I know people as well who have lost packages valued over $50,000. They did not insure them. They lost all the money. So it's very, very, very important to insure all of your high value packages to make sure that you do not lose your money. One package like that with $50,000 loss, could that could ruin a company and put them out of business. So be very cautious and make sure to always secure your money but not also secure your product when you're shipping. And when you're shipping internationally, make sure to verify the customs fees, okay? You need to talk to your representative with FedEx or UPS and when you're shipping internationally to make sure uh, that all of fees are handled by the person who is purchasing it and you do not acquire any fees coming in. So talk to your representative. They'll be able to explain more on that, but you want to verify every single country you're shipping into their customs fees and everything in order before you ship there. And the last and most important thing is customer service. Okay, guys, this is tough. I know it. Sometimes a customer isn't right, but in the scenario of business, the customer is always right. Suck it up. That's how it is. I know it's tough. I know customers are a pain in the butt, okay, but provide the best experience and the best customer service, and that will pay so many times over in the long run. You can use a help desk software as well to manage messages. So Zendesk, Freshdesk are very popular ones as well, where you can combine your Gmail and your Facebook and your LinkedIn all into one platform to reply to all of your customers at once. You can hire um, virtual assistants or in-house customer service representatives as well to manage those all under one platform. And I will tell you with certainty, the faster re you respond, the more sales you get. That is a fact. There is no doubt about that. So make sure you're quick on responding. Do the best you can to provide the best customer service and your business will be very successful in the long run. Next thing I want to talk about is the sales funnel. So I showed you the sales funnel, funnel for creating a um, and generating leads and finding new customers automatically. So this is the process of what you're going to do it. I like to call it hook story offer. If any of you are familiar with ClickFunnels or Funnel Hacker Live, this is where it came from. This is where I got it from. So this is not me speaking on my own. I give this 100% uh, credibility to Russell Brunson and the ClickFunnels team. Absolutely love those guys. So this is called hook story offer of my own version. Right off the bat, uh, hook. So you, like I said, you're going to create an amazing offer, something you can offer to somebody that nobody else has, okay? Or giving something away for free is a great way to do it as well. 
so you can give a free gift away. You can promote a giveaway contest, something like that. In exchange for this information or this offer, you're going to want to collect their name, their email address, and phone number in order for the customer to access it. That means you get access and authorization to email them in the future and to target them for advertising. So it's very, very important to collect their information right off the bat. That is called the hook. Next, we move into the story. Right now, guys, I am telling you my story, okay? This is a webinar. This would be considered my story. I created a story, a webinar training teaching you everything. I'm doing this 100% right now. This hasn't been an audition. This is off the top of my head, okay? So I'm letting you know that you're going to want to create your audience and gain their trust, okay? Be the best. Be very, very personal and get to know your customers before you try to sell them. Tell them your story. Tell them your success. Tell them your failures. They want to know everything. Um, you want to do the best you can to be 100% transparent with them and earn their trust. And from that point on, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to offer them something incredible, unbelievable offer, 10 times the value of what you're going to charge for them. Okay, so this is selling them access to your company or selling them product or whatever it may be, coaching, training, however you want to package it together. You can provide this offer. And let, let me tell you a few things about creating an amazing offer. The number one thing you want to do is add limited availability. Okay, when you create an exclusive offer and add scarcity to it, the demand increases like crazy. A lot of companies do that. Uh, Supreme is a clothing company that does that, that limits their amount of clothes. And now somehow they sell jackets and stuff for two to $3,000, okay? They put limited availability on their stuff, which increase the demand. You want to do the exact same thing with your offer. And also include testimonials. You need to verify your credibility in this industry. As you watch this training session, I put in 10 to 15, maybe even 20 testimonials of all different companies who I have worked with. Okay, you can contact those companies and talk to them and ask them about Hayden and Trade and Tech. You're going to hear amazing things. But people need testimonials. Okay, they need to verify that other people have worked with you and you're a good person. So video testimonials are always the best, um, but... You, just either way it goes, provide those testimonials to people. So that is Hook Story Offer. Very, very important, guys, for part of the sales funnel. Make sure to screenshot that or save that information because that will provide a ton of value to you in the future, and you can look back on it. Next thing we have, my favorite section, personally. This is my expertise, marketing. Let me start off by saying if you are not a brand, you are a commodity. And what I mean by that is you... If you do not advertise your company and build a brand around your company, not only your personal experience, then you really have no true equity value. When you need to be involved in your company in order to operate and be successful, that lowers the value of your company, especially when you come to sell it. So like I said, build a brand, build a company name. Don't build it off your name. Build it off, like I said, Trade in Tech, Mass Mobile, We Sell Cellular. All of these companies are very, very successful and popular. So how do you build your company and where do you go to build it? Right off the bat, guys, social media is the best place to go. And in this industry, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, those are the three platforms you, would like to, you should begin with. Facebook has tons of groups. You can create your own business page. You can advertise on there. It's a great way to reach out to people and get them engaged. Everybody's on Facebook. There's no doubt about that. So your clients are on there. Another thing, Instagram. Instagram is one of the most popular things right now, if not the most popular platform. Okay, Make sure to put in effort and gain a presence on Instagram because you will be able to gain customers. Your customers are there. We do gain customers every single week from there. Instagram is a great platform to interact with people. And of course, LinkedIn. LinkedIn is the business-to-business -business platform. It's one of the best places to go in order to meet other business owners. I currently have nearly 14,000 followers on LinkedIn. I've been able to generate millions of dollars in business just from there as well. So make sure you create your LinkedIn profile. You have a company page as well, and you're interacting on there constantly. Now, e-commerce platforms. If you want to get known for sales and everything, 
eBay, Swappa, B-Stock, Newegg, Amazon, Walmart, all of these e-commerce platforms are great places to sell and create a presence and meet new customers. So I suggest always starting with one and expanding from there, okay? So start with eBay if you want to. Grow it to the level of 100000 or 200000 a month where you're doing very well consistently and then expand onto new platforms. There is no point on taking on 10 platforms at once if you don't even have one built yet. So focus on one, grow it, and then expand onto other ones. Next thing as well is very popular is WhatsApp, Telegram, and Facebook trading groups. So these are places where you can interact with people, um, with people who create WhatsApp and Telegram groups um, with other traders in the industry or people related in the industry. And Facebook groups as well is a great place to list your stuff for sale and to conversate with other people related in the industry. So we have all of our private groups as well that we run for trade in tech specifically um, for all of these platforms too. It's a great way for customers to interact. And the last thing, one of my favorite things, the number one lead generation strategy for us is paid advertising. Guys, Facebook ads, Google ads, and retargeting with both of these platforms is the way to go, okay? I have generated millions of dollars in revenue, let alone met thousands and thousands of customers. And just this last week alone, we did a new ad campaign for our Facebook group. We generated over 1,000 leads. We sold $4,500, and over 1,400 people joined our Facebook group. We spent $1,200. Okay, it was a very, very, very profitable campaign. So look into Facebook ads, look into Google ads, start learning from those because they're very, very valuable. And that is the marketing section as well. So read over that, screenshot that information and start being active on those platforms I talked about. So next we have, this is a mouthful guys. This is the expansion, okay? So when you're taking it to the next level, or if you already are a company that wants to go to the next level right now, uh, these are a few strategies you can use in order to take it to that next level. So right off the bat, we have selling on e-commerce platforms. So expanding your sales channels, you can sell on platforms like eBay, Swappa, Amazon, Newegg. I said Walmart as well before. Those are all great channels to expand and start selling your product on. So if you want to make more money, start selling in more places. Uh, next thing that's very important, international wholesale. So start wholesaling to countries like Dubai, Hong Kong, the United Kingdom. Those are very, very popular areas. So you're going to have to go on the internet, look on trading platforms, and start exploring and finding people in those industries. Like, Let me remind you as well, make sure you always keep your money secure and always get references from people you are working with before. When they're working in different countries, you don't know who they are and you need to make sure that you're secure at all times. So get those references and make sure that you do your due diligence before shipping to anywhere outside the country. Next thing you can do is apply for capital. Everybody needs more money if they need to grow and especially in this industry, it's very cash intensive. So make sure to check in to um, see where your capital standards are at and how much you need in order to take it to the next level. And you can raise capital through private investors. You can also get it through bank loans. And you can also do things like seller credit. So whether it's PayPal credit or credit cards or companies like Cabbage as well, these are all ways to raise money. I would highly suggest trying to find and raise money under 10% APR. Anything over that gets really, really expensive. Banks will loan it to you less than that if you have the money. If not, you can use credit cards but pay attention and make sure you pay off your balance at all times so you don't get hit with interest. Credit cards have 20 to 30% interest rates, and that is very detrimental onto your business and your bottom line. Okay, so when you're raising money, making make sure you get money at a good price. Do not just take the money if it's available to you. Another thing I want to talk about is managing clients with CRM tools. So a CRM tool is, uh, means a customer relationship management software, okay? And so what these software programs do is they record all of the activities, conversation, interactions with your customers. Um, there's a lot of different tools out there. Ones that are popular are HubSpot as well as Pipedrive are a lot of CRM tools in order to manage a customer's experience. 
So when you expand, you're going to want to put this information together so you can collect the data um, and analyze it for further investments in the future. Another thing you're going to want to look at is automating your marketing tasks with software. Guys, this is so important and this will save you so much time. It is worth the money. Automate tasks like email marketing, social media posts, paid advertising, retargeting, follow-up replies. All of these things can be automated. You can use tools like MailChimp. You can create chat bots as well. Figure out ways to automate your tasks. If you're posting on social media regularly, use, use programs like Hootsuite or Social Pilot. And you can go on there and you can schedule 100 posts in advance or even 500 posts in advance. That's what I do. I only schedule my posts one day and they go for two months. It's pretty freaking crazy. So use these software tools and you'll save a ton of time. Um, and the last thing you want to do is outsource routine tasks. If you're a business owner or you're a top salesman, your only responsibility is figuring out ways to generate more sales. If you're doing customer service, if you're doing data input, if you're doing social media management, if you're writing blogs or creating other content, you are wasting your time. The owner of the company is the person who grows the company. The top salesman of the company is the one who produces the revenue for a company. If you are doing anything besides generating sales and focusing on making more money, you are wasting your time. Outsource your routine tasks to virtual assistants or to other people and focus on sales and generating more revenue. That is how you grow a company. So guys, this is a lot on the expansion side right here. Take a screenshot of this, record it, um, however it may be as well. Um, look back at it So, in order for you to see some success in the future. Um, I hope that was a lot. It is a lot of information, so I hope I could provide some invaluable insight to you. All right, so let me tell you, everybody visions themselves running a successful company. So whether you're at $0 right now, you're doing a million dollars a year, you're doing a million dollars a month, you're doing $10 million a month, whichever level you're at, you always have to keep this vision in mind. Make sure to always offer the best product, cause no harm, use a business to inspire and implement solutions to automate your work. When you do this, and you focus on providing the best customer service experience, your company will grow and it will grow very fast. Guys, in 2012, I did $165,000 in sales. And in 2018, in a 12 month cycle, we did over $10 million in sales. So our growth rate within six years was massive. And that's all because we provided good product and good customer service and focused on automating tasks that weren't making us money. All right, guys, so let me tell you everything. Number one thing you need to make sure you do is eliminate the problems. Every problem has two solutions, a temporary solution and a permanent solution. While the permanent solution takes longer to solve, it will solve more problems in the future. All right, guys, do not half-ass anything. Excuse my language if some people do not like that, but let me tell you, nobody likes somebody who slacks off and does a half-quality job, okay? So if you have a problem, if you have an issue, if you come across anything in your business that can be resolved only once and avoid it again, make sure you make the permanent solution and eliminate those problems so you don't have to deal with them in the future. That is very, very important. So be consistent with that and work hard and always do the best you can to your ability and it will provide a lot more success for you in the future. Okay, and these are just a couple simple rules I follow for this industry. Number one is outsource and automate. Like I said, it is very important for you as an owner or the top salesman or whoever you are in your company to be focusing on growing the company. And the only thing that grows the company is marketing and sales. So everything else can be outsourced to assistance. Figure out ways and the things you need to outsource in your company and make that happen. Number two, always secure your money. I know a lot of people in here, including myself, um, in this industry that have lost a lot of money due to scammers, fraud, issues with that. So I highly suggest secure your money at all times and only work with the most trustworthy people. Do not take risks. Do not do it. It is not worth it. Make sure your money is always secure. I hate to see people lose money to fraud and scams. So I just 
say it over and over and over. Always secure your money. Use PayPal. Use escrow. Only make payment after you inspect the items, however it is. And so always do your due diligence and always secure your money. Now, last thing I, I say to a lot of companies, and I, I'm very strict on this with my company as well, is we only purchase items to fulfill. We didn't buy a thousand iPhone sixes hoping to sell them. We bought a thousand iPhone sixes because we had a thousand sold. Okay. So only purchase devices that you know for sure you can fulfill in an order. Now, if you're buying things for a hundred dollars and they're selling on selling them for two hundred dollars on eBay, you have the margin, you can see what is sold. That's a safe purchase. Okay. But if you're buying something in wholesale for a hundred dollars and they sell for 120 wholesale but you don't have a buyer, well, why are you even purchasing in the first place? You're just tying up money. So I suggest only focus on purchasing to fulfill orders. Don't do anything other than that. Okay, guys, and you need to promise me, I've, I've provided a lot of information in this training so far, but I need you to promise me one thing, that you will stay consistent and not take any shortcuts. This industry, the best companies in it have the most have the best consistency and chemistry in their companies as well. Okay. Do not take shortcuts. Do not, you know, half ass it. Like I said, everything else. Work hard, stick with it, be consistent, and you will find success. So make sure you commit and you promise me that you're going to take action in these manners. Okay, I want to tell you a few more success stories. Some of my good friends. Uh, number one of them is Dylan Bryant. He lives actually in my same condos here in California. Uh, he's one of my really good friends. I've worked with him for a long time. I've taught him quite a few software programs he can use to automate a lot of his tasks. And he told me that using software to automate my marketing tasks allows me to focus on sales and growth. And it's exactly what I was talking about, guys. Dylan now, instead of reaching out and trying to find customers over and over, he has that completely monetized. The only thing he does is focusing on generating more sales and more and growing his company more and marketing out to new people. He doesn't have to do with all these other tasks and he's automatically generating more leads as well. And so Josh as well, uh, he's from Tech Liquidators, um, really good friend of mine. He told me that I, his biggest problem was constantly updating customers with his inventory and prices. I quickly started using Hayden's strategies and saw an instant boost in sales. So Josh created an inventory management system that he monetized and kept up to date. And his customer could then order from him consistently by just looking at this inventory list. And he also did the same thing for a purchasing price list as well. He bought from people and he would send them out price lists. And when he sent out price lists to everybody, they would be able to see what he paid for it and invoice him and he would pay for it and then ship it to him. So creating these purchasing price lists and these inventory lists automated his sales process and helped let him generate more sales because it was pre-made and customers could look at it instead of him having to send it out to him every single time. So those are just a couple guys that were very, very successful in our industry and currently operating as well. So guys, that was quite a bit of the training right there. We went over workflow, we went over sales funnels, we went over marketing, and we went over expansion on how to take your company to the next level. I also want to provide advice over and over again, making sure that you provide the best customer experience possible, okay? It takes a million years sometimes to earn a customer and one second to lose them, okay? So provide a great customer experience at all times. All right, don't take any shortcuts. Eliminate those problems with permanent solutions. Commit to yourself and make sure that you are going to do this. Eliminate those problems and avoid any issues in the future for what you can. Remember those rules to follow, okay? Everything I talked about, automating and outsourcing, okay? As well as securing your money with PayPal, okay? Those are all very, very important things that you need to remember. And also remember, commit to taking action. Everything I've taught you here is irrelevant if you do not do anything about it. So stand up, make something happen, commit and make a change and you will find success. Now, let me tell you, I won't really want to ask you, is it your time? Are you ready to take your business to the next level? Are you trying to go to a million dollars? Are you trying to go to $10 million? Do you even want to take it to a hundred million dollars and beyond? 
I want to know, is it your time? Are you ready? Because I really hope you are. I got a lot to provide you and something really awesome I want to offer you too. So here's what I'm going to do for you guys. I told you I'd offer you something special at the end, and I am. And this is no joke. This is something pretty freaking serious. Nobody else is doing this, I promise you. So here's a few things I'm going to do for you. Number one, I'm going to show you my exact strategies on how I grew my business to over $10 million a year. Okay. I'm also going to give you access to the tools I use to grow and manage my company to over 30 employees. This includes all the software programs, all the inventory management programs, all of the social media management programs, everything like that. And I'm also going to give you direct access to the best wholesale suppliers for smartphone and electronics in the entire industry. Okay, guys? That is something nobody in this industry will do. Why? Because everybody keeps their clients private. But I'm here to offer you something that's extraordinary and different than everybody else. So I'm going to give you direct access to them. So let me tell you, though, this, is, this special offer is only for a few people. And you have to be related to this. Now, if you're a reseller and you want to explode your business to the next level and meet buyers and sellers, this is for you. And if you're a wholesaler and you want to find and find new clients and automate your marketing tasks and sales tasks, like I talked about, this is for you. And if you're a retailer and you want to learn how to take your business to the next level and begin purchasing, and even selling in wholesale as well, this is for you. If one of those does not relate to you, this offer is not to you. But I promise if you made it this far, that you're going to want what I have to offer. Now, guys, let me tell you, if you work with anybody in this industry, you're going to find that the good guys, they're more expensive and the bad guys, they're cheaper, but you always want to work with the good guys. And when you work with the best, you will pay more, but you will get the results you want. So I only, and I suggest to you as well, only work with people who have proven results and are successful, pay the difference, pay the extra price because they are worth it. Quality is not cheap and everybody wants quality. So I'm going to let you know, if you want any of this to work, you need to put in the work. You need to make a plan and you need to stick with it. I can tell you my good friend, Brian Levy, he took my advice. He put in the work yeah, and he built good relationships and he succeeded. And he's telling you guys too. He says, take Hayden's advice, put in the work, build good relationships and you will succeed. And same with Rich as well, one of my good friends. He's actually coming out here to California. I'm pretty excited. He said, I'm glad there are people like Hayden who've been there and are willing to share openly and honestly. Guys, I'm an open book. I have nothing to hold back at all. Reach out to me at any time. Send me a message, and I'll be able to help you out, okay? There is nothing that I'm holding back or you know, trying to hide from you. I want you to succeed as much as possible. I'm going to do whatever to, I can to make sure that happens. Okay, so guys, I have a special offer for you, and I'm not going to offer this out to many people, okay? This is limited, it is very, very special, to say the least. There's no other way to put it, okay? Now, I got a lot for you, and I want to show you what I have for you. So right off the bat, I'm going to give you access to all of my contacts, 70,000 industry contacts. These are USA retail and wholesale companies, phone and computer repair stores, IT companies and pawn shops from all over the United States. Over 70,000 of them it includes their name, phone number, address, website, emails, all of that. I'm also going to give you access to all of the government certified recyclers. So these are R2 certified electronics recyclers. These are the companies that are responsible for properly data wiping your devices before they are resold on other markets. When companies like Verizon, AT&T take your phone for a trade-in, they are sold to these companies and properly refurbished and wiped. These are the companies you need to go to in order to buy very large quantity. I'm going to give you access to all of the R2 certified electronics recyclers, all of the corporate buyback companies, and many IT asset reclamation companies as well. I'm also going to give you access to all of my emails. Guys, this is crazy. Nobody is doing this. Let me tell you, 150,000 email addresses of cell phone and computer stores, wholesale buyers and sellers, industry-related contacts. Every single person in the industry that matters will be on this email list, okay? I have made 
hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars just from this email list. It is absolutely, absolutely amazing. Another thing I'm going to offer you as well is all of my personal clients. Okay, guys, this is over 400 companies, 140 of which we purchased from, 250 of which we sold to. This is everyone we have ever worked with to sell over $30 million in sales. Unbelievable. And I promise you one thing as well. This is the coolest thing ever. I, with this whole thing, will make sure it's organized in Excel documents, put together for you nicely, and I'll make sure you get updates for life as well. Every time we update this, every time we put out a new client list, you get free updates as well. Absolutely phenomenal. Nobody else does this. Nobody else offers this. I'm the only one. I can promise you that. This is some of the most valuable information you're ever going to have. Everything in this entire offer is what took me to a level of $30 million and beyond. Now, guys, why am I doing this? Like, really, people ask, why are you doing this, Hayden? Like, what's the benefit of this? And I'm, I tell them. The used industry is expected to reach $50 billion in revenue by 2022. And this is according to International Data Corporation, a very valid source. And I want to help you take over the market. I want to see you take it to the next level. My only success and my only true benefit to seeing this is seeing you succeed. I don't really get excited by money. Okay. I don't get excited by materialistic things. I get excited and I live my life trying to help other people. And when I help other people and I see them succeed, that pays more than any dollar could ever be valued at. And so I want to see you guys take over the market and succeed. And it is becoming massive and you can make that happen. So why do you need this? Well, let me tell you, these opportunities are very, very rare. I've been in this industry nearly a decade. I can tell you exactly who you should work with, okay? And my results are proven. I have made the Inc. 500 list as one of the fastest growing companies in the whole entire United States. We've generated over $30 million in sales with these contact lists as well. This company, this information, all of this I have is a very rare opportunity that not a lot of people get access to. I mean, when was the last time you heard of a company that did this much and offers all this insight. It's pretty phenomenal. And so I'm telling you, this opportunity is not available all the time. And if you can even find it from somebody else, that would amaze me as well. So guys, that's not it, okay? I wanted to offer a lot more. And I have some bonuses for you. I got some actually multiple bonuses for you. So I'm really, really excited to provide them. I'm gonna tell you, if you're interested in this, this is what you're also gonna get. First thing you're going to get, I'm going to give you exclusive access to my live trading groups. Okay, so these are my WhatsApp, Telegram groups, and more as well, where we talk and interact thousands of different traders on a daily basis. Okay, we're buying and selling phones. Um, we're looking to sell electronics or new relationships. Whatever it is, these live trading groups are extremely valuable. They have thousands of active traders, and I'm going to give you exclusive access to them. I'm also going to give you exclusive access to my step-by-step -step marketing guide. Now, guys, this is what I told you. I'm going to give you all of the strategies, all the techniques, all the software, everything we've ever done to become a successful company, and it's all packed together in this marketing guide right here, okay? These are all the strategies, everything I've used. I put a ton of work into making this and pro providing you with the most insightful information Nobody is doing this, let alone doing all of these techniques. So this marketing guide alone is what took us to the level we are at. This is something you really, really need. And the last thing I'm going to give you as well is I'm going to give you our purchasing and inventory price list templates. So these are templates you can send to your customers or you can keep them updated on a weekly basis or they can use just a link to click on them. You can provide your inventory at all times or your purchasing price list for things that you're purchasing at all times. So people can go on and they can look at this information and they can buy or sell to you without you having to reach out to them. And these are extremely valuable. We've used these for six, seven years and generated millions of dollars in revenue just from maintaining these as well. So I have created the exact templates to cover all the Apple, Samsung, Google, and other products as well. They're very popular and traded in the industry. All right, guys. So let me summarize this entire package for you, okay? Number one, you're going to get my 70,000 industry contacts. I charge $2,997 for this, okay? I'm not going to be charging you that. That's 
a really high price, but a lot of people pay for it. You're also going to get access to my 150,000 email addresses. I usually charge $1,997 for all of those, okay? You're not going to be paying that price either. On top of that, I'm going to give you access to my government recyclers. Now, these are all the R2 recycling companies, okay? I charge $997 for that, okay? I'm not going to be charging you that price either, okay? Well, one of the most valuable things that I still honestly can't believe I'm giving this away is my personal client list. Now, multiple people have paid me $5,000. Some have even paid me more than that for my client list. I'm giving these, this to you guys as well, okay? And the bonuses that I talked about, you're going to get access to my live trading groups, okay? This is a $497 value, okay? I this These trading groups are only for people who have watched my training programs. Okay, I do not give them to anybody else. So you are going to get exclusive access to thousands of traders on WhatsApp, Telegram, and other platforms. Okay, they're also going to get my online marketing guide, the step-by-step -step instructions on how we sold over thirty million dollars. Guys, I have done so many marketing consulting deals for so many people. They've paid me tens of thousands of dollars. This marketing guide I put together and I sell to people for $997. Okay. It is extremely valuable and a lot of companies purchase it from me. Another thing you're going to get as well is all my purchasing priceless templates. You don't have to go through and figure out how to design your own Excel template for inventory and for purchasing. I ha I've done it all for you. Okay. I charge $497 to do that, guys, all of that put together. And on top of that, I'm going to make sure that you get free updates for life, all right? That I loan charge $1,500 for, $1,497 to be exact, because I have to maintain and update this. And the last update took us almost 300 hours to put together all of this information, guys. So it's very, very valuable. We work very hard, and it's very well organized, okay? So the total value for everything here, that I charge for this is $14,476, okay? It's pretty expensive, guys, but that's not gonna be the deal for you, okay? So I'm gonna let you know, there are only 100 spots available. I am not offering this to everybody. I am limiting this to how who gets it and how many people get it, okay? This is very exclusive, kind of a one-time deal that I'm doing as well, so make sure to claim your spot. But guys, I'm not going to make you pay $14,476 for this list. I understand that's really expensive, and plenty of companies have paid me that amount. But I know that a lot of people cannot afford that, okay? So I want to try and help out as many people as possible. But at the same time, I'm going to limit to the people that take action, all right? So I'm only offering this to 100 people. And just realize how much of value I'm really bringing here. I have spent over a million dollars alone in marketing for my company and spent hundreds of thousands of dollars on sales employees to reach out to these personal contacts that we have made and to develop and grow these sales that we have had. Okay, I'm giving you instant access to all these people. You also get access to all our WhatsApp and Telegram groups. So you'll instantly be able to contact and directly speak with over a thousand different active people on our platforms. Guys, this is all the value that you could possibly need and ever want for your business and scale it in the wholesale industry, okay? So I'm not going to charge you $14,476, but I will say only 100 spots are available. And right now, you can purchase this for $497, okay, guys? But you have to take advantage right now. There is only 100 spots available, and this is only for the people who take advantage, okay? This will not be available here very, very shortly. So purchase this. This is a fraction of an investment for what I have invested in my company to grow it and scale. I am not your competition. I am your best friend. Reach out to me. Let me know how I can help you in any way. Okay, guys, I really appreciate you taking the time to listen to this training. Thank you so much for spending the time with me and listening to me, and I hope I've helped you out in some way or another. Okay, now go out, take advantage of this opportunity, explode your business, and reach out to me and let me know about all your success. I wish you guys the best and happy trading.